Hey guys, this is Hydra from Max Trades, and in this video, we're going to go over how to create an options alert or stock alert using the X Trades app. So I'm currently on the web browser, um, and I on app, <clears throat> if you click on app.xtrades.net, you will um, yeah you'll be on this uh, website, and uh, from there you can log in, and then you'll have access to this platform. So on the left here, we have a bunch of different options. So um, to create an option alert, we're going to go hit alert and then uh, let me click out of it and then yeah, so we're in alerts now and here you can see all the alerts that have been made recently and uh, if you follow some people um, then you can see what alerts they have been uh, posting so it's basically like Twitter-ish where you can see what the people you follow have been posting what alerts they've been posting and then yeah this is how the ui looks really clean ui great job to the developer team but yeah anyway um this is the alerts page overview and then here you, and there's a bunch of filters here you can filter by stock or options filter by time and uh, you can also see the results so these are the past uh, couple trades these are the actual trades themselves the ticker symbol the time how long ago it happened or closed and then the result and the, the type of trade so yeah that's pretty much it and now we're going to go into how to actually create the alert itself so we're going to click create alert on the top here very simple so you got three options here so um we'll, we'll take a look at entry first so you, this is very simple you, you just enter whatever this thing asks you for right so if you want to buy or sell or short or cover so you got four options there and then you put the ticker symbol so let's say tesla right and if it's a stock trade then you want to click on stock if it's an option play you want to click on options so let's do stock first <clears throat> so for stock let's you just put the price that you want to or you bought the stock at so if i bought it at 215 then i'm going to put it there and then risk level uh is it high risk or is it uh, a low toe so this is a basically lottery so very very high risk this is like high risk in general and then standard is just the uh, yeah standard risk and then uh, strategy you got day trades swing and long term um, and then you also have this thing where um, this will notify the people that or this will notify when you post your alert that you are potentially looking to add to your position um, so that way people know and they don't go all in but yeah this is pretty much how you set up a stock alert and the same exact thing for options so for if you want to do options click on options expiration date um it gives you a calendar option and then you just choose um yeah your expiration date and then strike um i think yeah you got to choose an expiration date first so let's do that strike and now i can choose um the strike and then if it's a call or put and then the price of the uh, contract that I paid for and then again um, risk level and then strategy this is optional but yeah again day trade swing in long term and then I will add to this position again so type entry is uh, another way you can send alerts so take a look at the example here right it's the same exact thing so if you want to buy or if you want to do an options trade then you do BTO that means buy to open and then let's do Apple and then let's put in a date um so let's do 11 3 and then at 0 0.08 strike price yeah strike price 140c so 140c the c uh stands for call so if it's a put then you just do 140p it's that simple and then at and then you just put the price so I bought this for 45 cents that's what I'm saying here so again BTO means buy to open and then the ticker symbol and then the expiration date and then the strike price and then what you paid for so yeah it's that simple and then uh, for stocks it's the same thing but it's even simpler just do this so BTO buy to open Apple and at this price and then if you want to uh, sell then you do stc which means sell to close 
um, Apple at 171.2 right so it's that simple and then if you want to short then you do sell to open which is shorting basically and then when you want to cover you do buy to close um, but yeah those are the four options so again buy to close buy to open sell to close sell to open those are the four options and then again you just put the ticker symbol and then the expiration date and then uh, strike price and then call or put and then uh, the actual price but yeah it's that simple I hope this video helps you guys and feel free to uh, DM me or comment in the video if you guys have any other questions. Thank you. There's a reason why Xtrades is currently the fastest growing application on the market for sharing financial ideas. With over $2.5 million paid in the last two years to contributors, users are flocking to see what trades the top traders on the leaderboard are sharing in real time. If you're looking to grow your reputation as a trader on the internet or discuss your trading ideas with other reputable investors, click the link below and get connected with the trading mentor today, completely free of charge.